Welcome to the Industrial Talk Podcast with Scott McKenzie. Scott is a passionate industry professional dedicated to transferring cutting-edge, industry-focused innovations and trends while highlighting the men and women who keep the world moving. So put on your hard hat, grab your work boots, and let's go. All right, once again, welcome to Industrial Talk. Thank you very much for joining the number one industrial-related podcast in the universe that celebrates industry professionals all around the world. You are bold, brave, you dare greatly, you innovate, you collaborate, you solve problems, you make the world a better place. Thank you very much for what you do. You, we celebrate you on Industrial Talk. We are broadcasting here, IoT Solutions World Congress, Barcelona, Spain. All the cool kids hang out here. You need to put this on your calendar next year. It is a great event, one worthy of traveling. You get to meet and greet just industry trailblazers who are all dedicated to solving your problems. So make sure you put this on your calendar for next year. In the hot seat, his name is Mark. He's the head cheese for this particular event. Yeah. See? Yeah. And he is going to just sort of share some insights and thoughts about what's going on. So let's get cracking. How are you doing? I'm good. It's at the end. Yes, finally. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You've, but, been, you've been chirping and talking yeah. and lying. We are excited, yeah, I mean. but we are really, really happy. Yeah, it's yeah. it's. I got to tell you, it's been a great event. Yeah, it has been a great success. So I love the venue. I love what you've done. Everybody and all the feedback that I've received mm-hmm. throughout the three days. Yes. Absolutely positive. Absolutely looking forward to next year. Yeah. And and the the conversations, quite mm-hmm. frankly, have been one that that have changed. It's, it's, you know, even in one year, Mark, one year, we were talking. We weren't talking. We were talking AI, but we were just still. It was sort of theoretical. Mm-hmm. Now it's like, oh yeah, everybody's doing it. Everybody's yeah. got to do it. We got to. It's like, so, like, yeah, you're fan club. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I have fans. You have fan. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure if they are joking to me, but uh, yes. Oh, well, they're they're definitely. So, what made? What do you think made this particular event this year um, an improvement, or what have you sort of focused on this time around? Well, uh, first of all, let me tell you that we have put a lot of efforts from our side to to be more international. I mean, yes. uh, after the two editions uh, that we celebrated post-COVID, obviously the event uh, was international, but it was more focused on, on the EMEA region because some countries in 2023, they were not allowed to travel internationally yet. Yeah. Right? So we have put a lot of efforts to bring international delegations from China, from India, from US as well and from well, from over the world, right? So that's one important point that I wanted to highlight. The second one is that we have changed the program direction this year. Uh, so before 2023, we were working with the IIC and this year uh, the program direction belongs to the ESA, the International Society of Automation. And I think that they have done oh. a great, uh, a great uh, job for the Congress. So yeah, we are yeah, happy as well. Oh yeah, I, I, I got to tell you, it, and and the layout, uh, I, you know, you we we sort of look at a conference and and just experience the the level of knowledge, mm-hmm. and and uh, it really is one of those uh, events where you truly walk away mm-hmm. with a greater appreciation or understanding or new knowledge on yeah. where you want to go and that means it translates from my perspective into success mm-hmm. into success of business and that's why it's important yeah. to encourage individuals to come to this particular event because you will you will benefit you yeah. will walk away better yeah and and this year we have uh, tried to split the content of the congress in four different rooms uh, one room per one of the challenges that we have identified that the companies will uh, need information from. So one room was focused on the tech enabled transformation concept. The second one was uh, for solutions focused on climate change and sustainability. So we feel that it's really important to, uh, to know how the technology is going to help the companies achieving the sustainable goals up to 2030. The third one we know that this is not a sexy topic, but it's necessary to talk about the standards and regulations. And finally, oh, yeah. and finally, uh, IoT security and cybersecurity. So I think that that 
Well, uh, it worked very well to try to classify the tracks in, in different rooms and obviously the auditorium with the most important keynotes. But I, uh, well, I think that is one of the key of this success as well. I, I, to add to that, um, everybody talks about being uh, digitally enabled. I'm a manufacturer. Uh, mm -hmm. I want to have the ability to see what's happening in my organization. That means it's a connected type of uh, strategy. And in that connected type of strategy, I don't think, and I think what's brilliant with this particular event is the connection between all the activity that exists within IoT, the devices, the collection of data, and cybersecurity. And I don't think, I think it's, you have one side of the coin and the other side of the coin, and I don't think that you, you have to have that you know, focus on cybersecurity. If you want to be connected, cybersecurity. And that's expanding, right? Yeah. Yeah, exactly. So we expect that in 2027 or 2030, we will have more than 30 million of devices connected. So, so the cybersecurity makes completely sense, and this is why we have tried to connect the uh, IoT Solutions World Congress with one important track being the cybersecurity. So it makes sense. Yeah, it's the right thing to do, yeah. and I think that that that, uh, from my perspective, separates this out. There's. There's the focus on cyber, but this one has that whole uh, Congress area that you can definitely dive into and, and get some great insights yeah. as well. Yeah, so. yeah, for sure. So we have tried to cover and add other disruptive technologies as well uh, in, in the program. So obviously, um, the artificial intelligence is a hype currently. So we are calling uh, I, AI IoT, something like this. Huh. Uh, have you heard about this? No, no, I, I, I just know AI. Okay. Uh, I was talking to Siemens, and I said you need to have everything's branded X. Okay. So <laughs> it needs to be AI X. Yes. Why, why yeah. not? Yeah, so, so, fly. so basically, uh, IoT uh, as a general concept, that's fine. But we have tried to add more technologies on the stage, right? Digital twin, machine learning, edge computing, etc. And we. Well, we want to show what it's possible to do in the industry, providing solutions focused on these specific technologies. Do you get a sense, and, I, and this is a leading question, do you get a sense that we're still sort of at the infancy, we're still at the new, I mean, it, things have been around for a little while, but because the technology and the innovation mm -hmm. is traveling at such a rapid pace, I still believe we're just not we're still at the beginning of, yeah. of the benefits associated with what we're talking about here. Yeah, 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 correct. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it is. Well, I, 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 think, I think just in general, Mark, you guys have done, your team have done a, a, just a stellar job. Yeah, I think that one of the keys, one of the key of this success is the amazing team that we have here. In amazing in the IoT Solutions World Congress from the first one to the last one. So they have put a lot of efforts to make it possible uh, from the visitor side, from the commercial side, also from the marketing. So I think that, uh, well, uh, without them, this is not possible, right? So no. only 12 people managing this event. Uh, See, good. that's just, that's crazy. Yes. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. When you look around and you're going, Wow, <laughs> all of the little pieces and parts, and, and, and they just sort of came together, and, and they yeah. just do. And, 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 and the, the participants, as well as the conference goers, it's, it's, it's a memory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm so, so grateful to have this, uh, yeah. this team, Jeez. and it's an honor for me to work with them. Yeah, you're, you're awesome. So, and, and thank, and thank you. Yeah. You are well, part of the thank team you as very well. I much right? appreciate that. <laughs> thank you. Um, what do you recommend people, how do they, uh, when are you going to have some information about next year's and so we can start uh, promoting that? Well, uh, first of all, we're wanting to finish this year, yeah, uh, yeah. but yeah, but for next year we will do our best again. So we will analyze which are the trends and the technologies that we want to cover and in which specific verticals. But obviously, if it's possible, we will, I want to add maybe healthcare and continue talking that's, that about sustainability. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah. Yeah, people are talking about healthcare. Yeah, we will see. Yeah, we'll so, see. Thank you well, so you're much, wonderful. man. All right, okay. listeners, we're going to have all the contact information for Mark, as well as IoT Solutions World Congress, Fair of Barcelona, uh, also the Barcelona Cybersecurity 
Council as well out on Industrial Talk. So you got to find out more. Do not hesitate. You need to be a part of this event for next year. So be on the lookout for all the information. We are once again broadcasting from IoT Solutions World Congress. Barcelona, Spain is the location. And again, you need to be here next year because it is a fabulous event. As you can tell by Mark, he knows his stuff. All right, we're going to wrap it up on the other side. Stay tuned. We will be right back. You're listening to the Industrial Talk Podcast Network. That was a great conversation with Mark. Absolutely wonderful. They're doing great things at Team Fair Barcelona, IoT Solutions World Congress, and Barcelona Cybersecurity Congress. Both events, one location, must attend. Put that on your calendar. Uh, next year is going to be bigger, better, stronger, faster. And, you know, I'm a big advocate on educating, you know that, collaborating and innovating right there at that event. All three are being done right there. So put that on your calendar. It is a must-tend event. We're going to have more conversations coming from that event, so always be on the lookout. All right. Industrial Talk is here for you. I say it all the time. It is a platform. It is an ecosystem that celebrates industry professionals. You have a podcast, you have technology, you have solutions, whatever it might be, to help educate the industrial community. Put it out on Industrial Talk. Be bold, be brave, dare greatly. Hang out with Mark. Change the world. We're going to have another great conversation shortly, so stay tuned.